Ah, good afternoon, so I'm here with my Mark 1 Capato 0.22 cal. Uh, this is my oldest P PCP, I've had it nearly five years now. The other one, the other one 0045, serial number. And I'm going to shoot some Hades pellets, it's 15.89 grain. Now I haven't shot these outside 25 metres, but today I've uh, worked out a way of shooting out to 32.5 metres, which is right on the back of my range where I've got my steel sheets are. Uh, I've got a 3mm target air pellet trap out there. And uh, I've roughly worked out the holdover, so I'm going to attempt to put all 10 pellets inside uh, a 15 centimetre uh, HFT training target circle. Uh, it's pretty calm today. I've got my pard NV008, which is roughly zero to 25 metres, so I think I should be able to do it if I can get, just keep my breathing steady. So, first of all, I'm going to zoom in on the target. So that's uh, nearly 26 yards out. There she is, and uh, what I'm going to aim at will be the right hand, upper right hand, 15 millimeter circle, which is obviously, as you look at it, is to the right on the low, on the lower line. Yeah, upper upper lower line. Okay. So here we go. I'm also going to record this through the pad as well. And hopefully, get all ten inside the target. Side, to the right.
that for the final shot. Get the magazine out. Alright, that can off safety on. And uh, Okay. So we'll zoom out. So that's 32 and a half meters, uh, nearly 36 yards. Uh, the wind is a bit breezy down there. You can see the wind blowing occasionally, so it's not too bad. Uh, we're going to pause this, going to bring the target up, and have a closer look. Be back soon. Ah, good afternoon. So I'm back with the results from my 32 meter, 32 and a half meter, and uh, it's 36 yards shoot with my Mark Compatter here, 22 caliber, uh, testing the Hades 0.22 cal pellets. They're 15.89 grain. Now you think, take into account the actual design of this pellet, uh, it wouldn't be particularly uh, accurate or aerodynamic. But uh, this target here, and I don't, don't forget, I mean, everybody knows about my hernia, my breathing problems, and to be honest, it's, it's not too bad today. Much better than what it was when I shoot my, uh, my early gun the other day. Uh, but the grouping I got was, well, very good. That is a 15 uh, millimeter circle there, uh, HFT training target. There's 10 Hades through the middle of that, okay? Uh, so yeah, that's, uh, that's a three quarters of an inch, uh, five pence piece. Obviously that'll easily cover that, yeah, 18 mil over 15 mil. So that was off the bipod, um, shooting at say 32 and a half meters. So is the Compato uh, more accurate than it over again? No. Um, is either of them uh, better than the other? Well, it depends who's, whose hands are in really, I think. I mean, I've had this one for a long time, nearly five years old. Uh, Reliable. I had a little issue. I had an issue at eight and a half thousand pellets where the um, slingshot collapsed, but that was replaced in the warranty the first year, and she's been brilliant since. Um, very consistent, um, accurate, uh, lots of speeds. The pad sight has been very good. Uh, when set up, it holds its its electronic zero. Um, I was using. I've got a, like a drop down uh, reticle on the on the pad. I wouldn't say it's a mill dot, but it's it's got gradients there. And I was using about three gradients holdover um, at uh, 32 and a half meters. I think I originally zeroed her at 25 meters. So yeah, uh, I'm not sure whether they're mill dots because I was only using one mill dot on the Urigan um, at that range, at the same range. So, but then again, that we're using the lighter pellet, 14.35 40, 40, uh, grain pellet, where this is the 15.89, which is obviously two and a half grain heavier. So yeah. Uh, I really like my Compato, it's one of the rifles I, I, shall, I shall keep because I've had it such a long time. It's my first, my first PCP and uh, she's been really reliable. I like the, the adjustable power, you've got three power settings. Uh, it goes down uh, but it's about 11 and a half, uh, 9 and a half and the lowest setting is about just a 6 and a half. So I think I tested it last time I tested it. Um, yeah, really nice rifle. Um, I like the safety, we can just flick it off in the, in the guard. Yeah accessible safety um, yeah it's just a great rifle um, it's got a, a the stumpy I have on it is a, is a second uh, second mark and it's, it's modular so you can actually split it so this is like a half stumpy I've got here but it's more than quite enough the compactor is not particularly noisy on its own but that little little stumpy that half stumpy just uh, really quietens it off yeah if you want to do some back guard back guard shooting okay so yeah uh, accuracy wise very good. Um, the Hades, I've tested them against the standard uh, jumbo pellets, uh, and to be quite honest, they're just as accurate. Yeah, the Hades is, is an actual very good pellet. Yeah, very impressed. Um, so, yeah, can't argue with that. 10 through 15 mil, very good. So, I hope you like that little review. Thanks for watching.